Jenny and if it does sit in the UK and as you can guess the bookcase is gone <laughs> be happy as soon as they've got the they reversed the lorry up to the gate I thought well that's a good sign it's a big lorry for a start <laughs> then he lowered it and I went it's going <laughs> yeah he really liked it he said it's really nice surprised the others didn't take it but I said I've been told they're picky but it's gone I got the corner back again yeah it's not going to be a corner of doom so I'm going to eventually put a table here I want a table and that's so we can eat down here and that and craft and everything else and that but yeah I've got me London one which I got from the range I love that one that's one of my most favorite I love that one and uh I've put the ship one up that I got from Craft Buddy Crystal Art. That's a really old one. One of their uh, ones from the start when they first started. But that reminded me of Diana Galbert and Voyager book. So I had to get that. And it's slightly up higher because there was a cross stitch there. And that came down today when we moved the bookcase. Well, when they moved the bookcase. And I've got it sat down here. It's a lavender and lace one I've done. Um many moons ago and that but yeah it, the hook came out uh, so I thought oh well that lasted a long time <laughs> so I've got to try and get that back up again and that so yeah I've been stitching tonight whilst I've been watching YouTube all the ghost hunting ones that have been uploading tonight and last night I've done those I have been enjoying myself watching it all heaven I love watching ghost hunts and um Yes, so I got this one out that One Day Saving sent me, the witch. It's coming along nicely. I've done loads on it in the last couple of nights. And you can see her now. Uh, so I've done lots on the blue, all that corner there. I did while chatting to Kira this afternoon. Well, not this afternoon, this morning. Uh, so she had a phone call. Um, that, so she's applied for a job. So I think she's got it. So we're quite chuffed and that, but yeah. So we were chatting a lot. I thought I'd send some stuff up to her in the post for it. But yeah, but you can see the arm. I think that's an arm there. Looks like an arm. But yeah, it's seen more in the camera than I can looking at it. And that, so yeah, so it's the witch. I think that's a cat down the bottom. It's got to be a cat. And that's so, and you've got in a world of princesses, be a witch. And as I keep saying, my mum loves anything to do with witches, owls, robins. Witches is mainly her favourite. <laughs> anything witchery, she loves. And that because two years ago I done her a big diamond painting with the three sisters. And that, so yeah, the three witches. And she has that out as a fire guard. She has it in front of the fire. Not when it's on. I said, but I said, when it's been on overnight, you don't put it back until it's really cooled down. She went, okay. <laughs> so it's it survived. It's still still going. She hasn't burnt it. <laughs> but no, she loves that one. And she's got a little one as well I've done. But yeah, you like that. Love that. See the face now, look. Really see the face. I couldn't see it before, but that's a tree going up. Uh, but I've done loads, done absolutely loads in the middle there. Lots of black and lots of grey and blue today. And uh, But that's been me most of the evening. I don't normally show the back, but you can tell. I'm, actually, I'm not a neat stitcher. Never have been. Never will be. <laughs> but, you know, you can see how much I've done. So I've done absolutely no. So Mum says, have you finished it yet? I went, do. I've got two owls coming. I think one's a diamond painting. One's a cross stitch. I ain't telling her about them. Do I get halfway through it? Because <laughs> you say, have you done it yet? I've got another one. Dragons in a cauldron I haven't done yet. So, yeah, she knows I got that one. I got that last year. It's out there with the stash pub. <laughs> Whoopsie. But, yeah, no. 
as you can tell I do like thinking I go mm -hmm, that's a mum and landscapes and houses and me and London I adore London and the Eiffel Tower I've got loads of the Eiffel Tower and I love those I've got another London one on my fireplace I want to try and get up here because uh, I might put the cross stitch over the fireplace try and get some hooks and put that over there because I don't think a mirror's going back up because that fell down the other year that was weird and um, it didn't break I find that a bit weird I thought it would have broken but it didn't uh, so I've got another another London one on um, that I've put on a canvas so I want that to go with this one over here I really like it and I want to start the big London one Christmas one did I say I'm obsessed with London? <laughs> my dad's from there and my nanny granddad and that so yeah so London has a special meaning for me and I love London and that but I have been thoroughly enjoying this tonight I shall put it away because I need to go to bed because I've got to get up in the morning early <laughs> but, uh, I'm the air cut <clears throat> and that so right I'm gonna go I hope you have had a Good Halloween. I hope you're staying safe and staying well. And I'll speak to you on the next one. Bye.